Islands ruled by animals. Human population has been growing exponentially over the last few decades. We have destroyed the natural habitats of many animals to create cities and industries for ourselves. The number of critically endangered species is on the rise, and it's high time we do our best to protect them. Under such circumstances, it feels wonderful to know that there are certain places in the world where animals roam freely without any danger. If you're interested in knowing what are the islands that are roamed by animals, then please keep watching. Number 1. Catalina Island Santa Catalina is a small island in California. The island is just 22 miles in length and 8 miles in width. The island is home to a large number of bison. In 1924, a film crew imported 14 bison for shooting a movie on the island. The movie was called The Vanishing American, and apparently, the scenes with the bison did not make it to the final movie. Due to the expenses, the crew decided to leave the bison on the island rather than taking them back to the mainland. Today, the bison herd has around 150 animals. Although Santa Catalina has a population of around 4,000 people, 90% of that is confined to Avalon the island's only incorporated city, so the bison herd and the other animals on the island have a lot of areas to roam about. Number 2. Pig Beach Commonly known as the Pig Beach, the uninhabited Big Major K city in Exuma, Bahamas is swarming with adorable feral pigs. The pigs live on the island and the shallows surrounding it. It is believed that the pigs were left there by a few soldiers with the intention to come back and turn them into a delicious treat, but they never returned, causing the pigs to increase their population and make the island their home. According to another story, the pigs were actually shipwreck survivors. They somehow managed to swim to the island and survived. While one legend says that the pigs escaped from an inlet located nearby, the other says that the pigs were introduced purely for tourism purpose. Whatever the story behind these pigs, they surely have attracted a large number of tourists to the island. Number 3. Japanese Island of Tashirojima in the small Japanese island of Tashirojima, the human population is just 100. On the other hand, the island has around 600 cats, six times the number of humans. This feline domination dates back to the mid-18th and the 19th centuries. During that time, the island residents raised silkworms to weave textiles. They valued the cats as they used to drive away mice from eating the silkworms. The cats were constantly being fed by the fishermen, and their population kept on increasing. There is even mythology that says that fishermen started considering the cats as a good luck charm and built a shrine for them. Today, the island is taking advantage of the cat-loving tourists. There are numerous cat-themed and cat-shaped cabins across the island where visitors can spend the night. Also, dogs are banned from the island to help the cats flourish and live a stress-free life. Number 4. Assateague Island An uninhabited Assateague Island's real owners are not humans but wild ponies who roam around the beaches freely. Some say that they survived a shipwreck whose remains can still be found beneath the sands of the beach. Assateague Island is an uninhabited island in the United States whose northern part lies in Maryland while the southern part lies in Virginia. The island is home to a rare breed of horses who have been on the island since the 1600s. Known as the Chicontique Pony, these ponies have a rich legend behind their existence on the island. Legend says that they are the survivors of Spanish shipwrecks. But experts believe that it is more likely that they have been released on the islands by colonists who were looking to escape livestock laws and taxes in the 17th century. Today, there are around 300 ponies living on the island, with around 1,000 Chicantique ponies living off-island as they were either purchased or taken by private breeders. The Chicantique ponies are smaller in stature when compared to mainland horses because of the poor habitat and diet on the island. Moreover, at various points in history, the introduction of blood from different breeds combined with uncontrolled inbreeding led to the characteristics that we see today in the ponies. Number 5. Deer Island in Japan Nicknamed Deer Island, Miyajima is a Japanese island inhabited by over 1,000 Sika deer. The deer roam around the historic shrines of the island and are found near the iconic and sacred Tori Gate. They are really friendly and accept food from visitors. Miyajima in Japan must be the only island where deer and humans enjoy living side by side. According to the local folklore, the deer in Miyajima were once considered sacred. 
They were worshipped as messengers of God. Even today, many deer hang around the Tori Gate, the most prominent landmark in the Itsukushima Shrine. The deer in Miyajimi interact freely with tourists. Most of them live in the 500-acre Nara Park that has a number of shrines and stone lanterns scattered around. As of 2016, there were more than 1,200 deer on the island. Number 6. Makari Island Makari Island is an isolated island in Tasmania's Australian Antarctic Territory. The island is teeming with seabirds who have made the island their home. Penguins, petrels, and albatrosses are the primary breeding species. But the most widely distributed birds on the island are the penguins. There are four species of penguins on the island. The royal penguin is endemic to the island and it is their only home. They have a population of 850,000. The other penguin species include king penguins with a population of 100,000, gentle penguins, and southern rockhopper penguins. All in all, the Antarctica government has estimated the number of penguins on the island to be around 4 million. Nearly 100 years ago, these penguins were exposed to cruelty when they were used to produce oil for lamps. This made the population of 3 million penguins reduced down to just 4,000. In 1919, this practice was banned. In over 80 years, the penguins were able to recover their population. Moreover, there's an ongoing program that eradicates predators from that island in case they are seen to harm the penguins. Number 7. Steel Island Duker Island in South Africa is home to one of the largest colonies of Cape Fur Seals. These adorable creatures have made the rocky island their home. There are around 6,000 seals that live on the island and can be seen sunning themselves lying on the rocks. Regular ferries and boats take visitors to get a glimpse of the seals. The island has come to be lovingly referred to as Seal Island. During the birthing season around April, adorable little seals can be seen huddled close up to their mothers or learning to swim in the waters. Number 8. The Brazilian Island, Ilha do Cuimada Grande Ilha do Cuimada Grande is an island filled with poisonous vipers. The island is located off the Brazilian coast in the Atlantic Ocean. The island is home to a critically endangered venomous species of snakes, Brathpus insularis or the Golden Lance Hand Pit Viper. Decades ago, the island was connected to the mainland via a land strip, but with rising sea levels, the connecting land mass went under the water and the island was completely disconnected from the mainland. As a result, the snakes were stranded on the island. With the pressure of survival of the fittest, the snakes quickly adopted to the new environment. They multiplied aggressively, rendering the island dangerous for human visits. Today, the island is closed for the public as a protective measure for humans as well as the snakes. Only a few researchers and the Brazilian Navy are allowed on the island. Number 9. Okunoshima Island in Japan also known as Uzagajima, which translates to Rabbit Island in English, this Japanese island is a paradise for bunny lovers. During World War II, the island was a chemical weapons research and manufacturing site. The island was kept a secret during the war, and it didn't appear on any Japanese maps. The story is quite different today. Tourists flock to the island and get a glimpse of the hundreds of rabbits who have made the island their home. How the rabbits ended on the island is still a mystery. Some believe they might have been test subjects during the war, and after the war, workers may have released the remaining rabbits. But according to Ellis Cross, a Japanese politics professor, not one test subject survived after the war. He believes that the rabbits are descendants of eight rabbits introduced to the island in 1971 by school children. With no natural predators like cats and dogs on the island, the rabbits spread aggressively, and today there are around 1,000 bunnies roaming around the island. Number 10. Tiny Christmas Island in Australia Christmas Island was once home to an estimated 43.7 adult crabs, or about 0.09 to 0.57 adult red crabs per meter square. But in recent years, the introduction of a very specific ant, the yellow crazy ant, has reduced the crab population to around 30 million. For most of the year, the crabs can be found lying in the forest, but once a year something wonderful happens. Millions of crabs come out from the forest and go toward the ocean for the breeding season. The migration happens between October and December. Crabs from across the island make their way towards the ocean. The male crabs first reach the shores and dig burrows. 
The females then reach the shores and the mating takes place in or near the duck burrows. After the mating process, the males return to the forest while the females stay in the burrow for about two weeks to lay their eggs. Once the incubation period is over, the females leave their eggs in the ocean, mostly during the high tide of the last quarter of the moon. The females return to the forest while the larvae spend three to four weeks in the ocean. They then return to the land as juvenile crabs.